Hey Pisces and Pisces lovers and friends. Welcome back to the Pisces portal. This is going to be a general reading for Pisces Collective. So this might resonate, it might not. Okay, let's see Pisces what messages we have for you today and see what's going on. Oh, okay, Pisces. Okay, okay. So we have this could be the one you've already met the romantic partner you seek. Ooh, Pisces. Who is it? Who is it? Let's see. Oh, abundance. You've done the work. Abundance flows to you now. Okay, Pisces. So alongside of you already knowing the person who could truly be the one for you, this card is coming out to say that your efforts in something um, is paying off or is going to pay off and you're going to um, receive an increase, okay? And this increase is coming towards you now. Ooh, okay, let's see. So we have compromise in reverse. Why is compromise here in reverse? And then we have release in reverse. Somebody here is a little stubborn or set in their ways and I don't know, not not willing to be open to other options or ideas, okay, in regards to a connection or could be in regards to work. We have jealousy here. And what else? Oh, wow. So I feel like someone won't stop being jealous. Why is this person jealous? Oh, hold up. Attraction. Pisces. Huh. You know what? I feel like someone from your past could be jealous of seeing you with someone new. Okay? And this person from your past, they didn't want to compromise with you. Okay? They didn't want to make things work. Now you're with someone new and they're, they're jealous. Okay? What else is new? <laughs> It's like one of those things where, you know, if if you are happy with me, you're not going to be happy with anyone else thing. Apology. Okay, Pisces. So, this jealous person... Um, Kind of lurking in the shadows who won't let you go because you found someone new um they feel really like remorseful for for not understanding you more understanding what it is that you required of them or not even not understanding but just not taking it seriously or not caring okay they're still really attracted to you and for some of you this is someone who you were with 
in a relationship um, when you were younger, okay? And now, you know, you've matured and this person still finds you attractive and, you know, they are definitely keeping an eye on you. And I feel like they're sorry that things didn't work out, but things didn't work out because of them. And, you know, again, they're, they're jealous, Pisces. Ooh, wow. I, mm, 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 mm. you know, for some of you, okay, this is probably a small portion of you, but for some of you, I feel like this person did reach out to you and, oh my gosh, it's like they're waiting on you to forgive them, but I, mm, I don't think that's going to be happening because you're already involved with this other person who you are uh, way, way happier with, okay? And also, too, it's like, you know, this person from your past, you really, when you were with them, you were with them, okay? Like, totally and completely. I'll just put this here. And now it's like you've more than moved on, okay? And I feel like you waited for them, you know, for some time to compromise with you, but it just did not happen, okay? There were just some things that this person refused to do, refused to let go of, okay? I For some of you, I feel like this person, one of the things this person refused to do was to like, um, like move in with you or let you move in with them or for the both of you to like move to you know, the same city in order to be the, together. But that's just for a few of you. Um, and this abundance that you're waiting on, Pisces, is coming, okay? Ooh. Yeah, we have distance. There's too much distance to maintain this connection. Yeah, so for some of you, like... Maybe you wanted to be in a long distance relationship with this person. And um, because I feel like for those of you where it was like a location distance thing, maybe you wanted to be in a long distance relationship with them and it just didn't work, wasn't, you know, gonna work because they didn't want to, okay? You know, we have a red flag. Tune into the subtle energy you are receiving about this situation. Listen to the messages from your body. Trust your gut and your intuition. You know what I'm getting about this reading, which is honestly a little annoying. <laughs> but it really goes to show that, you know, people from your past can really come back and try to freaking take over, you know, and um, get in your spotlight and I feel like this is exactly what's happening with this person because it's happening in this reading you know it's just like they want to be back at the forefront of your mind they want to be relevant again okay they want to be significant again and you know they want the both of you to kind of forgive and forget but You've already moved on, you know? Oh, but this person, they are the ones who uh, want all this airtime. <laughs> they want all the airtime, Pisces. So let's see. Be willing to express love. Express love to receive love, okay? You know, this is what you've done. And this is why you, you know, you are already aware of or already with someone else, okay? Someone who was receptive to your love and, you know, your vision for the both of you, okay? Let's see what else. 
or what's the most likely outcome for um, Pisces and this old person? Exactly. The five of wands. Okay. Conflict and competition. You know, I feel like this person always kept you in a place of feeling like you had to compete, you know, or just do the most in order to have them. Okay. So the most likely outcome is not good. But I anticipated that honestly and what about the most likely outcome at this time for Pisces and this person that could be the one ooh, ooh, ooh. what is this what is this what is this so we have the two of wands in reverse and then we also have the nine of wands so I feel like you and um, this other person, you know, you've kind of been at a, at a standstill. And I feel like um, more so as individuals, you and this other person have gone through some challenges and I feel like that's probably why spirit is saying that this could be the one because you could be so focused on those other challenges that you're not recognizing that this might be the person that you end up being in something serious with. Spirit, what else do you want to say about this? Because this little person from the past just took over. So <laughs> let's see. What else? Ooh. The moon. Okay, so... I think for some of you, you and this person haven't quite yet even divulged your feelings to the other. Okay, so... And you might not even realize that both of you are going kind of like back and forth within yourself about the other. Thinking about them and all of that. Yeah, we have the three of wands. <laughs> okay, so again, Pisces, more waiting, okay? You're waiting for this abundance. Um, but I feel like, you know, you and this other person are waiting I feel like they're really waiting on you, honestly, to say something. And this could be a uh, a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or another Pisces, okay? Let's get an Angel Answers card to wrap this up. All right, so we have a year from now. Okay, Pisces, so perhaps in a year from now, you and this person who could be the one might be further along, okay, than you are anticipating right now, okay? So Pisces, this has been your reading. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you later. Bye.